Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. First of all, I would like to say Happy New Year. Um, this is 2022 already. It's January 17th and it's my first upload of the year. Uh, part of that is because I've been really sick. The first five days of the new year started off great. I was dieting. I was doing my 1233 challenge, which was good. But then I got a flare up from my autoimmune disease and that just completely set me back. So like the 9th of January, which was a Sunday, I literally cried three separate times that Sunday because I couldn't walk. But thank God that my um, doctor, my specialist doctor, was able to send a shit ton of prednisone, some steroids, and that has had me under control somewhat. Like, I'm already on my second round of prednisone because the first round didn't do it. And then on top of that, I got a cold. So, like, I was dealing with an earache, a sore throat, a runny nose. It wasn't COVID, but, like, I still... I still was sick and I still had a fever, which I'm better now, kind of. Like, I feel a lot, lot better. And also, if y'all see my dog in the background, don't mind her. She is currently sleeping right now. But that's my big baby. And yeah, it's been snowing today. It snowed a lot. We did go to the dog park, though. Even though, like, the cold makes my autoimmune disease a lot, lot worse. Um... I still feel like as a mother, I need to provide for my child. And I know that my child loves to walk and to run and stuff like that. So I did take her to the dog park for a little bit. So yeah, um, what else do I have to tell you guys? So let's see, the last two weeks of Dece December, I had people visit. And then also the first week of January, I had two of my neighbors visit me from Florida. Which is always good, like the traen el chisme de los vecinos. I do own, sorry guys, my nose is still a little bit runny. We do own a house out in Florida still, y la estamos rentando. So it's always good for them to tell us like what's going on in the neighborhood. Um, The house next door, like the house that's right next door to our house was sold. And we didn't know that it was so, being sold, but like that would have been a great house to buy for us because like we could have knocked down the fence and then just made one big house because we already have like the corner house but like the next house over was sold but we didn't know about that house that was being sold so anyways yeah it was good um so today i am doing a little haul of just things that i've purchased nothing major like everything is super super affordable some things are from walmart some things are from amazon and yeah like some things are from ulta target so yeah, let's get started, guys. I don't even know where to start, so it's gonna be super random. Okay, and the first thing I'm gonna show you guys are, are these hair clips. I love the color of these hair clips. I got them from the Dollar Tree, and no sé, me, el, el color me llamó, and I was like, I'm getting them. Plus, they were only dollars, so you can't really complain. So let's see. This is what they look like. And I bought two. So I'll put it on. So this is what the hair clips look like. I feel like they're super cute cuando estás a la carrera, you know, just put it on your hair. Okay, the next thing that I bought is a electric nail drill or an e-drill. Um, honestly, I had been wanting one for a long time. I bought this one on Amazon and I love it. So uh, the reason I bought this is number one, you know when you put your press on nails and then like I put mine on with crazy glue. I don't have it out right now. I don't know what I did with it. But I put my press on nails on with crazy glue and honestly like that's the glue that I feel like makes your nails last the longest. Like they'll probably last a good week and I will shower every single day of course 
and I will take a shower with really, really hot water because I love taking showers with hot water. So my press on nails will not fall off with the crazy glue. Like they'll probably start falling off, off after a week. But then here's where the nail drill comes in. It really helps remove um, the glue on, on your like actual nail now. So this is what it comes with, okay? It comes with the, the drill. And then you basically use the little, I think these are called bits. And then it also comes with like a lot more nail bits. But you basically use one of these and you put it through here. And then you connect this to the wall. So what you have to be careful about is I did see on Amazon that some of the um, drills did not come with this right here. So you basically have to, um, it's like a USB port that you, kind of like your iPhone or like your phone, how like you need the little box, the little square thing. So like I did see that some of them only came with the like USB, USB port where it didn't have like this, to, the outlet to connect to the wall. So I would definitely look out for that because it's like, kind of hidden when I was doing my research on them but yeah this is what it looks like and then I also love it to like do the cuticles on my nails like before I polish them love 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 and I am sorry that I'm drinking a lot of water but like I still feel a little bit like with the cough like <laughs> Okay, the next thing that I'm going to show you is I got an Alexa for Christmas. My nieces and my nephew from San Diego got me this Alexa. Honestly, I don't even know what it does. So, okay, the box says, Alexa, can you show me more? Alexa, wake me up at 7 a.m. with pop music. Alexa, turn off the lights. Alexa, show me the baby cam. This is mi perra stretching, okay? Alexa... Oh, it speaks in Spanish and in French. Um, Echo Show 5 is the name of it. I still haven't connected it. I do have the Echo Dot in the kitchen. But this one, I'm going to probably put somewhere here in my glam room. I haven't connected it. Honestly, I don't even know how it works or what it does. Okay. You guys know I am low-key OCD. I bought this um, libretita, it's called Pack This. So basically it's like um, a checklist for you to like, I don't know, check. I don't even know how many pages it has. ¿Cuántas páginas tiene? I think it has like, it says more than, more than 59 pages. It, more than 59 pages, but it doesn't give an exact number of how many pages it has. Okay. But basically, it's como un um, pack this list. So it has the basics, the miscellaneous, the clothes, and the hygiene. And for example, in the hygiene, it says toothbrush, toothpaste, dental floss, mouthwash. So it's basically like a checklist for things. Hang on, let me blow my nose. For things <clears throat> to pack. And I love this right here. Like, esta cosa es mi vibe. Esta cosa es como, I love this. So... And I am traveling. I should be packing right now, but I'm not. Uh, I am driving to Cincinnati, which is an hour away from my house tomorrow, to fly out. So, yeah. Okay. The next thing that I'm going to show you, I got on sale. It was like, I think it was $2.50. And I bought it because I really liked how it smelled. And it's $2.50. But basically, it's called Sugar Cookie. And it comes with a fragrant mist, a hand cream, and a nourishing hand soap. So the hand soap I am going to use in the um, kitchen sink. So, like, obviously not to wash the dishes, but, like, to wash your hands. 
And then this is the, the hand cream and this is the body spray. <coughs> I'm sorry guys, I am still a little bit sick. So yeah, I bought this one. And then I also bought these and I just feel like these are so cute. They're the Paris Hilton perfumes. I have no idea how they smell, but I just like the like the monitas, like the presentations because I'm going to put these on my um, display. I don't even know what it's called, but my display wall. Okay. Que más les voy a enseñar? Okay. The other thing that I'm going to show you guys is this um, color verde of nail polish. I feel like this green color has been in from the fall, like the fall of 2021. I feel like I've been, ever since then, I've been looking for a green color. Um, and honestly, like, I've been looking for this color green, but like, this is the green that I bought. And this is like, when it's on your nails, like, como se mira. But I feel like this almost looks like a black. I really want a true green. Like, do you guys see this green right here? Like, the green on the cap? Like, I want a this color green. Like, mira, se mira diferente. Esto se mira más como negro. What is that noise outside, by the way? I don't know if someone's like plowing snow or what they're doing outside, but there's like a noise outside. But yeah, like I've been looking for this color green, pero cuando me lo pongo se mira a little bit darker. But yeah, what the fuck is that noise? I have no idea what that noise is, guys. I hear like a noise, like a machine noise. Okay, um, another thing that I bought from Amazon, a faja. Okay, this is a small faja. Honestly, I could have, this one esta venia grande. But it doesn't matter. Um, I hear this noise outside. I'm not gonna be able to see outside either because it's dark. Um, but yeah, this faja is like this and it's big guys when i tell you it's big like me queda grande but that's okay because i'm just gonna like tighten it up i hate returning things on like amazon because i hate dealing with shipping i don't know i'm weird but like this one has the two velcros on your body so <clears throat> you can basically tighten it up to however you need it my dog wants to leave me already oh no no, you have to stay here with mom. So I bought this one right here. I don't know if I'm going to like it or not. I already know it's too big on me. I already tried it on. But anymore, I'm still going to use it. You got to stay here. Okay. The other two things that I bought, I think these ones I got from Sally's. And I've been wanting like this design on my nails. Oh my gosh, I hear like a lot of noise outside. Hang on, let me see if I can see. Oh, I know what it is, guys. Okay, I found out what the noise is, guys. So the noise is someone has a machine. Como it's like a lawnmower machine, pero es para mover the snow because I, there's like a Catholic school across my house, like literally right across my house. Um, there's a Catholic school, so mañana va a haber clases, and I think like they're like getting ready for to remove the snow. Para cuando vengan los niños, no hay snow. So that's the noise that I hear. I knew I heard a noise. Anyways, I've always wanted this design on my nails and I finally got it. I don't like getting I don't like getting acrylics because when I get acrylics, like taking them off hurts my nails so bad. So I hate getting acrylics. Okay. 
The other thing that I've got is this brown eyeliner by NYX. And honestly, I've been looking for a brown eyeliner, like specifically like a light brown, light brown eyeliner. I finally found it. <coughs> <clears throat> so yeah, I tried it out at the store. I got it from Ulta. Me encanto. I'm not going to try it on right now because when I tried it on, um, it, this is like a long wear. It's a waterproof. And it honestly took me forever to take it off. So I'm not going to try it on right now. I don't want to wear any makeup right now porque mañana voy a ir. I'm going to be on an airplane and I really don't want to deal with taking off makeup. Okay. The other thing that I bought are these cute little hoops. I honestly bought them for these two hoops. These are a medium or like a smaller size and these are a larger size. And then I'm probably not going to wear these. I'm probably going to give these away. Pero me encantaron estos hoops. I'm actually going to try them on because I feel like with hoops, there's there's some that I don't like how they set. Like just the way they hang on your ear. I'm really, really picky. But I feel like these are going to be super, super cute. If I can get them to like... Oh man, I'm missing... I'm chipping my nail. Look. Great. Okay, let me try it more. Yep, I'm gonna love these. I knew I was gonna love these. Look at how beautiful these look, guys. I don't have the back card on them. But as we Tan bonitos, like. Okay, these are the larger ones, and honestly, like, I mean, no me gustan los aretes grandes. Like, I just can't. Um, I'm more of a stud type of girl. Like, I like studs. I don't like big earrings, but it just me hicieron bien lindos. Guys, that's so cool. Like, someone is plowing. I think that's what it's called. Plowing your snow. Nice, como se dice. Um, but that's really cool. Like, I wish I had a plower, guys. Instead of like having to shovel your snow, you plow it. <clears throat> okay, like, I'm trying to put these earrings up. Okay, yeah, I don't know. I only have two more things to show you guys. The other thing that I bought, honestly, which I didn't need, but I just saw it and it was a great deal, are these um, bayonets, which I already have some cute little bayonets, which I showed you guys in my other video. And my other one actually comes with a holder, but these were only $5 and I couldn't like pass it away. Just the mirror alone, I was like, it's a dual side, hangable and standable mirror. So it comes with standard and then with magnification but I don't like this brush right here I already know I'm not going to use because I don't use round brushes <clears throat> but it has a paddle brush it has I don't know what the name of this brush is it has a travel brush let me open it guys no 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 porque mañana a lo mejor me lo puso and then it comes really nicely wrapped like yeah, I got it on sale for five dollars. I don't. I can't put them in here. Okay. So it has this mirror right here, which is a standard, and then a um a magnified magnified one, and then you can set it like this on your table, and then they said you can also hang it. This brush right here, I'm gonna donate the round brush. I already know I'm not gonna use it. Okay, and it has these little, um, like, clips that help you when you straighten your hair or something. You know, like you just put it up to move your hair out the way. It has this cute little travel brush. 
this comb. Guys, my dog is so bored right now. She wants to leave already, but she needs to stay with mom. Okay. Yeah, me lo termino. La otra cosa me compré son estos gorritos. What is this called? It says funky unique. mess in my room but anyways these are they come with three burritos my dog is worth <sighs> but basically these burritos i like because they have an hoyito at the top and this you can use it to put your ponytail through the top so But yeah, let me put this gorrito on. So this is what it looks like, but then at the top, you can put your ponytail through here for the tiene un odio. So you put your um, ponytail through here, which I love because honestly, casi siempre tengo el, perro, el pelo agarrado para arriba. So I bought this cream one. It came in a pack and then a black one and a gray one. Okay. La última cosa que les voy a enseñar porque soy una gorda are these candy popcorn by Snickers. Okay, I haven't tried them yet, but when I try them, I'm gonna let you guys know. Look at it, like, has anyone ever seen these? And cuando fui a la tienda, tenían otros. So tenían... Tenían... Snickers, tenían twigs, tenían M&M's, y tenían Oreos, okay? I'm going to try the Snicker ones out. I'm going to let you guys know how, it, how they are, but maybe I'll go back and buy, like, all the four different flavors. When I saw them, I was like, me, those are mine. Um, I'm probably going to take them on my airplane ride tomorrow. That's why I don't want to open them. Can I come? So I'll probably um, take them with me on an airplane tomorrow, but that is it, guys. Uh, I just want to say that I'm super sad about COVID and like how COVID still exists. Honestly, guys, I went to Steak and Shake today and my french fries literalmente me las dieron en un cup because they didn't have any more like french fry holders. Like y'all know when you guys go to like a rest like a fast food restaurant, cuando te dan las tapitas se las dan como and un um, holder, no tenía un holder, me la dieron un vasito. So I thought that was really sad. And then also, um, I went to a, a Mexican restaurant and I paid five dollars for a taco, guys. And they literally gave me like era un taco de asada. Me dieron the smallest strip of meat. Like when I'm telling you, ese taco ni tenía carne, like. Ese taco ni tenía carne. So I'm really sad about like COVID and I hope that it like, you know, it resolves and that COVID goes away because I don't want the United States or the world to fall into a depression. What I mean by that is like, y'all remember when the Great Depression happened? Um, well, we don't remember because I don't even, yeah, we were definitely not alive when the Great Depression happened. But yeah, like it's so sad and like support your local businesses is all i want to say like support your local businesses because i feel like they're the ones that are hurting the most but yeah um thank you guys so much for watching i know this was very like kind of boring but um i'm yeah like i just still don't feel all the way 100 percent. i feel a lot better from from where i was before but yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you guys aren't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys!